You know, one of the secrets to having strawberries and be able to harvest them organically isn't that you have to use pesticides, but you have to keep up on processing your crop. As you can see here, this is my strawberry bed, and there's still a lot of strawberries in here. I've picked all these strawberries in the last couple minutes, and there's still a lot to be had. But what happens with a strawberry bed is you get a lot of these little sow bugs and a lot of other little guys in there, and you have to pick them before the bugs get started on them. I pick them when they're just ripe. Tomorrow, all these will be too ripe. So, I'll let that one go another day. But if you let them sit for just a little bit too long, you'll start getting little bug bites all over them from the, the sow bugs. Also, if you can kind of pull them up as you're going, the ones that are still white, pull them up so that they're not sitting right on the ground. That helps a lot. That's pretty good. There's still a lot in here. A lot of little ones. And if they're, they're too ripe, like this one right here, um, actually, I just... I just throw them back on the ground, let the sow bugs have them. Uh, it'd be nice to be able to just come in here and poison them and put all kinds of stuff in here. But I, I like I like to be able to just take a fresh strawberry right from the patch. And I know there's no poison in there. The problem is when I start picking. I eat everything. So <laughs> there's still... There's still a good basket of strawberries in here. I've been getting from this bed that's four feet wide by 12 feet long, I've been getting um, at least one to two baskets of strawberries every day. And uh, I usually eat them as I pick them, but strawberry patches, gotta get one.